Next we'd like to draw a fan blade. So uh, this time we're not going to have the outer ring, we'll try drawing one in a different way. So the first thing we want to do, I guess, is find a plane that we can sketch on. Now that looks like a good plane to me, so that would be the XY plane. So I'm going to go pad, sketch, XY plane, and now I'm going to draw something that might be used as a blade. So. I mean, it could be spinning this way or that, but basically it's got to stay inside this shape here. So if I go, I don't know, something like that. It's probably a bit too much, maybe like that. I could then draw another one of those. This is pretty similar to the previous task. So we just, I want to avoid coinciding any of these anchors on there because they get stuck. And there, I could maybe just join those up with a couple of straight lines. Grab another one of those. Back in there. And now, what I want to do, you want to keep this fairly thick because it doesn't have the outside ring to strengthen it. So let's see what happens when we exit the workbench. So what I want to do, um, we don't want this to be any more than 75, so half of 75 is about 37, shall we say. So if I take that up to 37 and preview that, let's see what we've got. We've got a bit of a fan blade, haven't we? Okay, so the only other problem we might have is I think you'll find that the blade is actually now interfering with the hole. So we can easily fix that by going by setting up a second limit. So we click on more, and we're just going to move this one back. And now that's done.